Russia is developing new precision missiles as part of an overall upgrade of the venerable Panzer Short Range Air Defense System ADS, besides for an all-new monoportable anti-aircraft missile system MAMPADS. A modification of the Panzer SMSV is being developed on a track chassis for the ground and airborne forces. The system will have two types of anti-aircraft guided missiles and have an increased zone of destruction. Both works are planned to be completed in 2022, Lieutenant General Alexander Leonov, head of the military air defense of the armed forces of the Russian Federation said in an interview with the Russian Defense Ministry's newspaper Krasnaya Zvezda. The missile of the new Mampids will be equipped with an optoelectronic homing head, providing guidance to the target under the influence of all types of existing and developing optical interference, Leonov said. He told state media that the Panzer SMSV will employ two types of surface-to-air missiles and will have an increased strike range. Its work is set to be completed in 2022. Russia is also developing a new anti-aircraft missile system dubbed Titsilov that will employ two types of missiles with different directing principles, thermal and laser homing missiles, Russia's battlefield air defense chief said. Leonov said that in 2022, the development of a combat vehicle of the Typhoon PVO anti-aircraft gunners department is being completed. The armament of combat vehicles can include both the existing IGLA, IGLA-S and Verba Mampids, as well as the new generation Mampids being developed. In addition, the airborne forces will also receive the Ptitsilov air defense system which will have two types of missiles with different guidance methods, a homing target by thermal radiation and a laser-guided target acquisition system, the general said. The Panzer SMSV has been developed by the Russian defense industry to offer a new air defense system for ground and airborne units of the Russian armed forces. It will be used to protect S-300 V-4 air defense missile systems against attacks of cruise missiles, small drones, and precision weapons. As the original Panzer S-1 mounted on wheeled truck chassis, the Panzer SMSV will be armed with a mix of surface-to-air missiles and 30mm automatic cannons. It will be able to fire two types of surface-to-air missiles and will have a bigger destruction zone. The Panzer SMSV will be fitted with a weapon station mounted on the roof of an armored track chassis GM 5970.25 developed and designed by the Russian company Matishchi Machine Building Plants. The weapon station will be armed with two barreled 2A38M 30mm automatic cannons and 12 launchers for surface-to-air missiles, with six missile containers mounted on each side of the turret. The Panzer SMSV is equipped with a multifunctional targeting radar station, increasing target detection range from 40 to 75 km and engagement range from 20 to 40 km, thus twice more efficient than the current Panzer S1. It also incorporates a new multifunctional targeting radar station able to detect air targets with a range from 40 to 75 kilometers. As the Panzer SM, the Panzer SMSV will be able to fire the new high-speed two-stage missile 57E6ME which is a maximum firing range of 30 km, and the 57E6E with a range from 15 to 18 km. The 2A38M 30mm automatic cannons mounted on the Panzer SMSV will be used to destroy aerial targets at a short distance. The cannons have an effective range against air targets from 200 to 2,000 meters with a maximum altitude range of 4,000 meters.